Living in an apartment and owning a kayak have long been mutually exclusive. Boats are just too big to store and too cumbersome to transport. Oru is a lightweight, foldable boat, the original origami kayak. Made from a single, seamless sheet of double-layered polypropylene, this one-person boat can be easily put together in five minutes and folded back up in half the time. Weighing in at only 26 pounds, it's fast, sturdy, and light. The Oru can hold up to 300 pounds and is built for someone up to 6'4". When you're done exploring in the water, it folds up into a compact case that can fit into the trunk of a small car. That means it can fit in a closet back home or even be checked on an airplane. For something so simple and compact, this kayak has a lot of bells and whistles too. Watertight deck gaskets, a comfortable foam seat and backband, a shoulder strap for carrying, and even an adjustable footrest. And it's engineered to be sturdy enough even though there's no structural frame. Oru is as good as advertised. Suddenly, space isn't an issue. This kayak is ideal for calmer, sheltered waters. Like explore your local river or lake. While you won't want to hit the rapids or too many rocks in an Oru, it is built for durability. The hull is sturdy and rated for a minimum of 20,000 separate folding events. Founder Anton Willis has always loved a kayak, but he was living in an apartment that just wasn't conducive to his hobby. The inspiration for the Oru kayak started several years ago. I moved into a small apartment in San Francisco and had to put my kayak in storage, and at the same time I read this magazine article about origami, and that inspired me to start folding up paper models and uh, then full-size prototypes, and eventually uh, Oru kayaks. Four years and 20 prototypes later, Oru kayaks was born. Today, Anton's team manufactures the boats right in California, and all the parts are sourced in the USA too. Oru is named for the Japanese word to fold, and Oru is easy to tote, store, and ride. It's a revolution in kayaking.